Hi everyone, welcome back to another video. Today I'm here with Dalila Hentros. Hey guys. And we are filming a video for Outpro at Cafe Nero here in Montreux. So the three things we'll be learning today, number one is how to show a storyline in a short piece of content, authenticity, and also how to frame vertical videos. So Dalila, what are we doing today? So we are here at Cafe Nero and we are filming one of my brand sponsors, Outpro. And we're here with Busy Boy. As you can see, he's gonna be the star of the show. He's not really interested in this at all. Um, but yeah, we're gonna be shooting their new drink that they have launched with Outpro. So it's Cafe Nero Trans Outpro. Really excited. Okay. Let's do it. Okay, so we just filmed Julia walking down the street here to Cafe Nero and she was going from the left to the right in the frame. Now, in film, that means that the character is progressing through the storyline, whereas if we were to film Julia going from right to left, it means that she would be going back and either trying to figure something out or something wasn't right uh, in the film. So that's why we shoot left to right. Not right to left. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> I'll, I'll post that, people will be like, what the fuck is he talking about? <laughs> Okay, so there are a few reasons I shoot vertical when making Instagram videos. Number one is the fact that if I were to shoot landscape and then crop in for vertical, I'd lose resolution and the majority of the left and right of the image. When shooting in vertical, you know for sure how it's going to turn out on social media, as there is no need to crop. Secondly, vertical videos perform better across social platforms, so creating the best and most engaging vertical video is the best way to reach audiences online. Basically, this is the filming for the actual making of the drink. I was at 70 mil for a lot of that shot um, because one of the benefits of filming in vertical mode is that we can fill up the entire screen with the mug because obviously this is a vertical product, this is a vertical screen, so we can get really close up to the subject. Um, I shot it in 60 frames a second so we can slow it down, post, and um, yeah, see how that looks. Let's get one shot of your face just going like, yeah, like that. Yeah. Like, yeah. Maybe like going. Something. Yes, love it. So, what is it? Oat. Festive oat latte. Cinnamon squirrel latte with alcohol barista oat. Um, okay, so I'll say a cinnamon We just did the transition there where Julia jumps up in a normal clothes and lands down in her elf costume. Um, so I had the camera, I was hand held, holding it and we, she jumped up, I moved with her, she landed, she went to get changed and then um, we did exactly the same movement and this is going to be a, uh, a normal cut uh, together um, to show her in her, all of her beauty. Do you think it works? Very well. Okay, so the last thing is authenticity. So it all depends on the client, the model, um, and what their personality is like. Leela, how do you think you capture your authentic personality? Well, as you know, Henry, I can take the piss out of myself. So we're here in November, dressed like an elf, we're getting some weird looks, and we're rolling with it, and even busy is getting involved. So it's, been, it's fun. It's a Christmas vibe. It's a Christmas vibe. Christmas vibe. Merry Christmas. <laughs> Okay, so unfortunately I completely forgot to talk about and show you the process of capturing a unique storyline in this episode. There was a lot going on and we only had a small window to film in Cafe Nero. However, I will be covering it in a future video, so keep an eye out for that and don't forget to subscribe.
All right, guys, so that wraps today's video. I uh, hope you enjoyed my process on how to film short form vertical content. Thank you very much to Leela. You're welcome. I've loved it. You've been amazing, Henry, as always. Thank you very much. <laughs> I've linked all of her Instagrams and outro and everything down in the description. And see you in the next video. Bye, guys. Let's go.